Natalie Scarpacci is a petite teen with a big voice and even bigger plans. Annalise wants to star on Broadway. That was the dream since I was 10 years old. She's already landed Broadway roles in A Christmas Story, the musical, and Matilda. Pretty impressive considering she's been fighting a health battle since age 10. The first signs were evident after a summer ballet camp. I was under a lot of pressure and a lot of stress. And I came home and I went to the bathroom and I forgot to flush the toilet, as 10-year-olds do sometimes. And my dad noticed that there was blood in the toilet. Annalise's doctor referred her to Dr. Robin Sokolow, an expert in pediatric inflammatory bowel diseases. In the past, we would think about people who had inflammatory bowel disease as being malnourished, having bloody stools, having chronic abdominal pain. In Annalise's case, her tiny size compared to her classmates was a concern. It's a less well-known sign of Crohn's disease. It was me, and then the second shortest person was up to here. If you find that your child really has not grown and that you don't see any difference in the length of their pants or the size of their shoes, that might be something that may raise a flag. For Annalise, an IV infusion of a drug called infliximab every eight weeks helped her grow, gain weight, and for now, keep symptoms at bay. I could be walking in the street and people don't necessarily know that I am sick. And even though I'm in remission, I am still sick. A young woman determined not to let what is going on in her stomach interfere with the dreams in her heart. I'm Jessica Sanchez reporting.